believe that true democracy can only be an outcome of nonviolence. That's from Gandhi's correspondence with the government, 1942 to 1944. To me, this is one of the most important insights that Gandhi ever reached and that he ever shared. And it really explains in very large measure why our democracy here in this country now, not to mention India or anywhere else, is faltering. For me, it goes back to the discovery of the basic principle on which democracy rests, which is, and I'm going to have to use a word here, the sanctity of the individual. The sanctity to me simply means the infinite value of the individual, the individual being much more than an individual package of reality, but being a window onto that reality. Uh, I, you know, there may be better ways, more elegant ways of describing it, but it was the complete respect and value given to the human individual on which both ahimsa or nonviolence and democracy are based. So you really can't have one without the other and you can't have either unless you have both. <laughs> 